that sugar sweet You got what I need Sipping on the potion New Zealand has one of the strictest border controls during the pandemic. Finally, after 10 days, we are allowed to leave our quarantine hotel. As soon as the weather allowed, we sailed into the Haraki Gulf. The wind was gusting up to 20 knots, so we decided to use only the staysail, which is a small jib, giving us 5 knots of boat speed. We are trying to join the Pacific Island Rally in 2023 and the boat and its crew needs to do a lot of preparations. A CAT 1 certification is needed to be able to leave New Zealand waters. Checking and getting to know the boat and equipment, updating the systems are all on our to-do list. Our daughter Tara is coming from Wellington for a long weekend to visit us. It is good to see her in person after nine months and spend some family time together. Cooking, catching up, playing board games and just having a good time. The weather forecast in the coming days predicted too much wind, so we decided to visit Goat Island in Lee Marine Park. 20 years ago, it was teeming with fish here. Now we hardly saw any. We took the opportunity of windy weather to visit Auckland and enjoyed nice food. Tara decided that seafood is still okay for her vegetarian month. We strolled in the city and with my injury it is a perfect opportunity to try the electric scooter. And of course, we went to the New Zealand Royal Yacht Squadron, home of the America's Cup, to see the old mock. Of course, there is plenty of opportunity to have a workout on the boat.
it's always stressful to birth the boat, but today all went well, and it was time for a treat in Yogi's bar to reflect on the day. In the next couple of days, bad weather is coming our way, but after the weekend, the forecast is looking good.